Hi, my name is Victor Belfort, and I'm here with my sister Rodrigo Medeiros. And I'm gonna be showing you guys the workout that I do every day to improve my speed, my power, and my strength. And I want you guys to know if you wanna try to gain some weight or lose some weight, you know, this you can gain weight on this workout, but I I suggest you to get a personal trainer who you know who knows the workout with weights and you know your cardiovascular running and you know spinning or biking but this cardiovascular this cardio you're gonna get over here is the best cardio for fighters you know you you do specific training cross training with speed you know your your heart is gonna get you know it's gonna beat a lot you know what I'm saying you gotta you gotta focus on pay attention the position because what we're gonna do here I'm gonna work on jiu-jitsu techniques and fighting techniques to improve the cardiovascular the strength the power you know and all the tools you need to be a fighter okay let's start now okay guys here when you fight in jiu-jitsu or ultimate fighting you know NHB sometimes you have this kind of guard you know and what you're gonna do, you're gonna bring the legs and you're gonna pass the guard, dropping your weight, you know, that's, you know, is a technique. And the other one, you hear, and you see, you hear, and all of a sudden you pass the guard and you put the knee. This type of technique is that you passing the guard in different ways. But now, what you're gonna learn, you're gonna learn the first, you know, the movements in your workout, your abs, your legs, you're gonna feel your whole body. and. When I'm working out over here, he's gonna be doing his ab workout. See, I'm working here. He's working there too. See, here, 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 one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and he keep going 20 times. You see, he work his abs. I'm working to pass in the guard. And then you switch and you know and do it again. I suggest you guys to do three times each other, okay? And then we learn the first one, okay? I'm gonna do slow for you guys can see. Okay? First I grab the pants, okay? Or I put my hands on the knee if you don't have a gi, doesn't matter. I'm gonna go to my left side, I'm gonna make sure. I put this knee over here, like you're putting the knee on the belly, but you don't need to go and put it. You just want to use your speed, okay? Hold on. One, two, three, four, five, okay? That's the first one. And you gotta go fast, you know? And then, we gotta learn, we grab, the legs, okay? If I put my head to my right side, it's gonna be my hand too. I put the head right, be, you know, close to his hip, and I put my hand too. And now, I put my shoulder, all my weight on his stomach, and I'm gonna be jumping. One, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten, see, you change, and then you go on the side, see, simple, here, 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 okay, and after you do that, what you're gonna do, you're gonna do this, one, two, you do both sides, okay, same thing, you try to do 20 times each other, three times, after do this, we're gonna go to the other workout, you see, you're gonna go fast, your car is gonna be so pumped, but the difference here, you're not running, and you know you've been fighting, you know, you're doing fighting moves, but speed, you gotta work your speed. Okay, 
And now, what we're gonna work is the guy have his leg, okay? You here, you go. One, stand up. Two, stand up. Three, using your abs. Okay, when you go, use your abs. Stand up, boom. On the leg, boom. Okay, stand up. See you. If I attack to my his right his right leg, I make sure when I get up, I put my hand on the floor and I get up. Boom. Okay. If I go, I take his left leg. I make sure my left my right arm put on the floor and I stand up and keep going. Okay. It's a great workout. You work in the technique, but also you work in your abs. You work in the technique we learn, like, right? you know, this technique here. You here, boom, and you go foot lock. Boom, you go foot lock. Boom, you learn how to bring yourself up. That's the third one. Let's go to the other one. Okay, you guys wonder when you rest. Like, every time you're gonna have a partner, okay? You rest when he's doing. You have just short time to rest. That's why we, here's a cardiovascular work. You don't need to have time to, when you're running, you're not resting, you're running for half an hour. You're gonna be working this at least, like for half an hour, you know what I'm saying? You're doing three times each other. You go, your partner. And you're resting that time. But also, you're resting, feeling the pressure. Like, when you fight, you don't have time to rest. When you want to rest, the guy is putting his weight on you. You got to learn how to rest with pressure, you know? That's the work. You learn technique, speed, and you get your partner is going to put pressure on you. When he's doing, and you got to catch your breath with the pressure. And you get used to. You know, in the beginning, it's kind of hard, you know, if you're sore. If you, ah, 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 I can rest. But after, you're going to relax and you're going to be enjoying the, the work. Okay, let's go to the next one. Some guys, they stay on that position a lot, okay? And we, this is a very famous choke, you know? Put your hands over here, or another here you go, it's the clock choke, and you go for it. Okay, but to get on this position, we're gonna have to learn how to get over here. You here, what we're gonna do, we're gonna, one, you. See, I suggest you guys futurely not using your hands, make sure you're using your body. Okay, here, here, here. But if you can, in the beginning, use your hand. Boom, boom, boom. And here, you can choke, you can do a bunch of stuff. Make sure. I want you guys to learn how to pressure. You gotta feel pressure, okay? I don't want nobody, your hips up. Hips down, okay? Very low. And you see pressure on him. And pressure, you see my feet? Push all the time. Make sure, here you can have the choke, you can have a bunch of position here, okay? And you're gonna be working quick, okay? And then, same thing, you change. Three times each other, your partner go, you go up, you go down, your partner go up in the top and you guys be working. Next one. I put him in my guard. Okay? Now I'm gonna work the arm bar. Okay, I'm here, here, here. Okay, how we do? I start down bar. If I have my left leg towards his head, I'm gonna throw, use, you know, this leg here. I kick, I turn, 
I press and I put my right. Same thing, if my right leg is the last, I take it out, I'm gonna spin around, see your and put my left. Same thing, you can use no arm after, you just use your abs, you know, it's a great workout. You're using your abs and you use the technique to move your hip and, you know, to go to the technique. That's number five, I think. Okay, now I'm gonna stick my hooks over here. See, I put my hooks. Now he's gonna put his hand on the floor. I'm gonna be working my abs, as you can see here. One, two, three, four, five, six. You see, I'm using here. And when you finish, you get the technique, the American lock, and you do it. Same thing to the other side. Hold his wrist and work your abs. When you finish, make sure you have the American lock and you go for it. Okay? You're almost at the end of the workout. This is gonna take you at least half an hour, okay? I can do for like professional fighters, they usually do like an hour workout. It's long, you know? And then, now we're gonna learn how to work, you know? Another two moves, okay? Here, he stay like this, okay? What we're gonna learn from here is we're here, we learn. Boom, boom, boom. See, you're here, you change into the floor, pull the knee. Take the knee, go to the position. Here, 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 here. Speed, you know, it's very important. You learn your speed and you get quickness and you'll be fine, okay? It's very important because in the fight, everything is happening so quick. This helps you to get your cardio and help you to get control of the situation, okay? Okay guys, now what we're gonna do, we're gonna cross train with punching, okay? Like we're in the same position here, but instead of start over here, we're gonna start over here, okay? We're gonna bring our knee in the belly, here, and boom, 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 Understand? But fast, okay? What we're gonna do, we gotta do fast. Boom, 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 and grab, and we're gonna, and boom. Okay, we do 20 times for each side. Okay, that's the other one. And listen, this workout is very important. You're trying to do most, like, at least three times a week for you get speed, power, and strength. Now, what we're gonna learn, now we learn, learn, we're gonna learn a workout that we use is for strength and mostly like, more like you bench press the guy. Instead of getting a machine, what we're gonna go for is a workout for our upper body, okay? We work a lot of abs. This workout is a lot of abs worker. Now let's work the chest, the shoulders, okay, the triceps. Okay guys, we gotta get used to, instead of bench press, we're gonna bench press his body with his pressure, okay? One hand stick on the shoulder, another in the abs. He's gonna bring his leg up. He's gonna, I'm gonna be here. He's gonna put his arm, you know, like this. You know, I'm gonna be punching. You see? You bench press. He's gonna be staying here. His head gotta be stay here in the middle. Okay, make sure. Here, bate top mão para trás. He's gonna put his hand on the back and you're gonna be bench press.
okay? This one type of bench press. Why are we doing this? It's different than doing the machine. It's a body weight, he putting pressure on his body, you know, much harder. The other way, have me squat here. Yep. Yeah, he's gonna be staying here. It's gonna be the same thing, but instead of in the side, he's gonna be here. Okay, it's different. We have two type of bench press. Okay, you guys learn now to get strength. You see, this you can get weight with that, but I recommend you guys if you want to work like get your body stronger, you know, get a personal trainer for who can train you, you know, with weights in like in, you know, more specific for. You know this type of what you, the the goals you, that you want to gain weight. This is specific for fighting. Okay, you're gonna get strength and power. You also gain weight with this workout. But you know, if you wanna get more seriously, you know, trying to get more into the workout, get a trainer, a good trainer, and you know, put your schedule right and go for it. But just don't forget to work your cardiovascular is very important this type of cardiovascular fighting workout okay and I hope you guys enjoy the tape the workout and I see you soon okay guys you guys see what I want to show you is the workout specific for fighting but now I'm gonna show you how to do it I want you guys to understand the rhythm to see how it goes, you know. I wanna show you just, I'm just gonna do a couple sets, you know, I'm not gonna go hard enough. But I just want you to know how it goes, you know, step by step. But also, don't forget, if you wanna make harder your workout, you can get a guy heavier than you, you can add weights on your, you know, on your hips, you can add weights on your feet, whatever. You can make your workout harder, just be smart. But don't forget, more you do, more you get better, more improve your strength, your speed, increase everything that you need for fighting workout. Okay, let's start.
Okay guys, you guys understood a little bit the workouts. See, make you breathe harder, make you faster, but you also improve in your technique because you're doing funny moves. Just try to do this at least three times a week, you'll be set. Okay? Thank you very much for your company for your kindness, okay? Thank you.